Well, there obviously were all, you gotta get them. But everyone was off on that show. Yeah. Did, do you think you could do that show today? It's back on. Or he's doing it again. Really? Chris Hansen does it again. Yeah. We might have talked about this before, but I love when they get fucking Indian dudes. Why Indian dudes? Because they they're just like yeah, they're from India. You know what I mean? Oh, and, and they're in like, India, you're allowed to do that. Like, are, you, are you aware there's a 13 year old girl? He's like yeah. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> like, I'm trying to fuck this kid. Really? They're, yeah, they get foreigners all the time that are just like, I didn't know. That you guys have laws. About? Yeah. Really? So I feel what like are the laws pretty, in India? I, I don't want to besmirch India, but. Too late. Probably. <laughs> I think if you're from rural India, you can fuck whoever's out there. Really? Well, I mean, you think. Jamie. Boy, in the help, United States, <laughs> there's parts of the United States where the, the age of consent was very low up until yeah. recently. Yeah. Like, isn't it still, like, 16 in some states? I'm sure. I'm sure, like, especially states that are very religious. How the fuck is that not, like, a federal thing? Uh, yeah. You know? Yeah, the, the religious states, I think, where yeah. it's like you get married when you're 13. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Yeah. Mormons? What's Utah doing? There was one where if you, for sexual if someone had sex, the age of consent for boy, <clears throat> excuse me, boy and girl was different than boy, boy. And the reason Wait. for that is that's where the Catholic Church had moved a bunch of its priests. Damn. Yeah. I mean, I read that story like this. I, I got, I, I want to say it's New Mexico. I want to say mm. it was New Mexico. I think they fixed that. I might have just spread a bunch of misinformation fuck it <laughs> see if that's true <laughs> i was reading the india thing first <coughs> what's it, what's going on let's go with india there. first and then we'll go with the yeah we're yeah, covering I all the bases early. i don't yeah. know the answer to this i'm just giving you what i found why is that. consensual teen sex a crime in india oh, oh so. for teens to have sex with each other though okay all right well they changed the law a decade ago to make it tougher on cases of child sexual abuse oh so, uh, right. okay yeah. so it makes it criminalizes all sexual activity by children under 18. interesting so many uh have. consent adolescent boys in consenting relationships are finding themselves on the wrong side of the law interesting that's a bummer interesting that's why those guys are so fucking horny you ever see them online are they yeah, they'll fire Indian it up. Guys? Indian dudes will hit you really? in the comments. Show Bobs. Show <laughs> Vagina. Need Bobs. Show Bobs? I love you. Show by Bobs. Yeah, Bobs. What? They, say, they can't. They misspell boobs. <laughs> <laughs> they say, show Bobs, queen. <laughs> Marry me. Show Bobs. <laughs> really? Every, yeah, every hot chick's picture <laughs> is followed by a thousand Indian dudes. There's a billion people in India, but they don't have the same problem that China has. Like, China has that weird problem where there's way more guys than there are girls. That's crazy. Yeah. They fucked up. The fact that they didn't see the math on that, that one child policy. I think they'd be pretty good at that. The I, math. Yeah, I would think. Isn't that like a thing? <laughs> the guy I, know I don't know. I don't know anything about I that. I think that. <laughs> yeah. It's like, right. how the fuck did they not see where that was going to be a disaster in the future? Like, there's a whole generation of guys that have no girls. It's like, what are you going to do? There's yeah, no girls. They're going to get aggressive. What the fuck are they going to do? Damn. Yeah, not you good. Whack off the cartoons. Because, like, even in this country where it's 50-50. Yeah. Basically. Do you know that, like, 64% of men are single and only 34% of women are single? Huh. Like, how? How's that? How does that even work? Wait. 64% of men are single? Yeah. See if we can find the numbers. But I and think women... it's, it's men of a certain uh, you age. You know what it is, though? It's just men fucking chicks that are like, we're not dating. And women are like, no, we're in a relationship. You know how it is. I think it's a little of that. You're a fucking and girl, it's... and she's like, what are we? Yeah, right. Like, what have you been telling people we are? <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> we're nothing. <laughs> Can't I just use you, please? <laughs> Can't we just use each other? Yeah. Like the Bill Withers song? Unfortunately, I'm not a guy that, yeah, they want to they wanna date me. I'm not a guy that, like, oh, oh I just want to fuck that. You don't get guy. used? I'm not, like, a hot guy. You wish you were used? I don't know. Mm. Do you? Uh, <laughs> occasionally, back in the day, that was the best thing. Getting used. Yeah. Yeah. If you if you had a gal that was just just wanted to fuck, it's pretty neat. Oh my god, especially if you weren't into anything else. Because sometimes, like, 
the reality is sometimes you're attracted to someone that you're not compatible with. Yeah. But they're hot. Yeah. So you just, you're attracted to them sexually. Yeah. But the, the problem is usually that one person is into the other person more than, you know, there's like psychological elements yeah. to it that become a problem. Certainly. Yeah. And if the guy is the one using the girl, he's a piece of shit. But if the girl is the one using the She's guy. A boss. Like, yeah, great. Way to yeah, go. Yeah, she's a ball. We did flip that. Adults between 18 and 29 who say they're single. Yeah, this is it. So there's 51% of men in 2019. What? Oh, sorry. 51% of men in 2019. And by the time it got to 2022, it's 63%. So the pandemic kicked it up 12%. Mm. But the women stayed the same and just slightly more. More um, who say they're single, so 34% versus 32% for women. But the men went up 12 fucking percent. But what they're, I think what they're saying is these women during the pandemic started dating older guys. So when uh, the nice. jobs went away and everything went south, they, they shacked up with some dudes with money. All right. Probably. Well, that's fair. I mean, wouldn't that make sense? Like, look at 18 to 29 for men. 63% are single. That's pretty wild, but age 65 plus. 18 to 29? Yeah, and you look at 65 plus, 25% are single. 50 to 64, 28% are single. 30 to 49, 25% are single. So that's what it is. It's the 18 to 29 guys. 20 at 65 plus, <clears throat> there's more women because all the men are dead. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. That's about a, 40% are single. That's where it turns. Dudes are croaking. Yeah, look, as soon as it hits 50, the women start to move forward. Yeah. Because dudes start dropping dead of heart attacks, working 90 hours a week. <sighs> and just coming home and just hating their life. <sighs> it's got to feel good, though. What, to die? When you're like, oh, here it is. <laughs> oh, fuck, this hurts. <laughs> it hurts way more than I thought. <clears throat> That's a wrap. Yeah. Call yeah. it a day.